Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are looking at code forces round 859, problem D, odd queries. So we are given an array and we have been given some queries which are to be performed on a certain range, say from L to R. Basically we have to replace all of the elements from L to R with the number K and we have to check that after this operation will the sum of the entire array be odd. This is what we have to check. So for example, let's take this example and understand how to do this problem. So over here, we are given the example of 2, 2, 1, 3 and 2. And we have to perform these queries, basically 5 queries, 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. And how these queries work is like, suppose you are given the range this, from index 1 to index 3, right? So this is the range and we have to replace each of these with say number 5. Suppose this is a query, I'm just taking an example. So what happens? We need to check that after the operation is the sum of all the elements even or odd. So what we need to do is we need to have a calculation of what the total sum is and after that we need to subtract this sum and add this sum. So what is the part to be added? The part to be added is basically length into k. k is the number being added. So what is the length? r minus l plus 1. This is the length of any range times k. So this is the part to be added and the part to be removed is this. Now to go over each element and add each element would be very inefficient. That's why we used a pre-computation. How do we do that? We create a prefix array and store the sum of each element. So for 2, 2, 1, 3 and 2, the sum of the elements would be 2, 4, 5, 8 and 10. And how do we get the sum of this range is we take prefix array of R and subtract prefix array of L minus 1. So we take 8 and subtract 2. So 8 minus 2 is 6 and that is the sum of this range. So this is how we get the part to be subtracted. And this is the part to be added. So what we do is we take total sum plus add minus subtracted part and then we check if entire thing is divisible by 2 or not. If it is divisible by 2 then it's not odd otherwise it's odd. So let's look at the code. I'll just check my accepted solution. Yeah so basically over here I've taken n and q the number of queries and then the array itself and then we have created a prefix sum array and then we have also taken the original sum which is nothing but the prefix sum of the last index and then we have taken the range the number k and previous sum is basically the part to be subtracted and new sum is the part to be added and then original sum minus previous sum plus new sum if it is divisible by 2 then it's yes otherwise no that's it thanks for watching